tougher question for me to guard right now would probably be Kevin Durant. Uh, he's someone who's 6'10", 6'11", he's super got ball handling skills. Uh, I, just, I just think right now his level, he's played at such, such a high level, so for me, he's a good shooter. 50 from the field, 90 from the free throw, 40 from the three, so I say right now Kevin Durant has that. I did it. When I was a kid, I wanted to be in the NBA. Uh, I was sure Shall be uh, one of the shortest kids in my early on. And uh, I, I used to be, I used to come to Boys and Girls Club. I grew up in Boys and Girls Club High from where was I? First grade to about seventh or eighth grade, I was in the Boys and Girls Club every summer to camp. And I just think with me was, you know, the dream. My mom always said, hey, go live and try to go try to get your dream. And, uh, I had that focus, but I always had a plan B. And that's the key. Is in this case, if I did it, I went to college, I got my degree, so if the NBA didn't work out, I always had something to back, back my I'll go back and play. When I was younger, it, it, what inspired me was to be able to take care of my mom. Uh, you know, you obviously, you know, you, whenever you come up less fortunate, you always want the finer things. You know, if you're a kid, maybe you wanted shoes or a car or a house. And I, when I was a kid, I always wanted to provide for my mom and one day help her retire. And then once you get older, your, uh, your priorities change. So now I, I try to provide for my kids and try to be a good father and try to give them stuff that, that I didn't have growing up. Yeah. Hollow, swing, 